I don't really believe in coincidence. So who the fuck are you? Who shoots a guy in the ass? Drop it. How the hell are you still standing, man? Shot me in my wallet, put a hole in my brand new Billy Finns. I tell you what, how about I give you an IOU on your fancy pants and we just call this a misunderstanding, cool? I don't like to usually make assumptions in my line of work, but uh, you're not Anton Bagdanov, are you? That's not Anton over there. Oh, this? No, 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 no. This over here is Ivan. They're Bratva. And you're out of questions. Hey, hold on, hold on. I can help you track him. See, I'm looking for the Bratva, too. Here's what we're gonna do. I saw you turn that thing on. Pick it up, give it to me, without the ninja shit, and I won't blow your fucking head off. You broke it on purpose, didn't you? Just to be a dick. Look, I already tracked him. Says they're working at Pier 13. Oh, Pier 13? Mm-hmm. You wouldn't be fucking with me, would you? Because if you are, you're gonna have a little road time with Ivan the Terrible over there. That's what it says, man. One, three. One, three, huh? Guys, I found a link. Definitely Bratva. But there was a complication. What kind of complication? About six feet tall, Chinese, wears a designer suit when he's out murdering people. Yeah. It sounds like you stepped in a big old pile of organized crime drama. Well, it could be a shoe hitman. Hitman sounds about right, but I don't think he's shoe. I gave him the slip, but he's after the same people we are. You couldn't get him to work with us? The dude is insane. Ah, sanity's never been a prerequisite. I'm headed back to the hacker space. Let's see what we can dig up with the new info.
Hey, Josh. I ran your description of the guy through the police database, but it's not much to go on. That's why the police use sketch artists. Yeah, it was a long shot. It looks like it worked out anyway. What? In the dead sec channel? They say there's a guy that looks like your guy upstairs. Upstairs, like up... Stairs. Yes. In the game shop? Shit. Should we sound the alarms or something? Hey, no, nah, that, that'll just make it worse. Look, I'll, I'll go up there and handle it. Additions? What the fuck do you mean, additions? You had a, a group of people and some fucking dwarves or elves. Elves, if you're playing with those kind of fucking people. You rolled some dice, you killed a bunch of shit, and you got some cash. I, seriously, everyone in the world is playing this fucking thing. Why are you looking at me like I'm speaking sweet? <clears throat> oh, speaking of useless people, here's another one. Yeah, I followed you because I know you're full of shit, and I thought that maybe an example needed to be made, and I'm looking around this room, and I am seeing lots of potential examples. Pudding! I remember being killed by an orange pudding. Uh, th that's a black pudding? Orange would have been a jelly. I... Okay, I'll shut up now. Why are you here? You fucked me. I told you not to fuck me. I just told you what I know. <laughs> I've got enough bullets to put an I lose button right between the eyes of every geek in here. You really want to do this? No. Look, we'll go together. Hmm? Look, no, we won't. Man, you're going up against the Bratva's best hackers. You think they're not ready for some goon in a fancy suit? This is in my neighborhood. Goon? You're hurtful what you are. You're hurtful and stinging. I haven't done goon working in over a decade. Mm. But you know what? I like this new useful you. So I'm gonna go with that. Come on. Goodbye, pudding. Hey, don't call the cops, okay? I got this. I got this, y'all. So where are we headed? Looks like the Brafa's running an operation at the Crystal Springs Dam. Funny. I thought you'd say Pier 13. Yeah, uh, sorry about that. You know what? You have really inconvenienced me, kid. Bad enough, I gotta take a red eye out to this hipster shithole and deal with some serious hum- well, That's just fucking great! What was this? All right. You know what? You have really inconvenienced me, kid. Bad enough, I gotta take a red eye out to this hipster shithole and deal with some serious humidity issues. I mean, what the fuck? Sweating balls in the morning and freezing them at night. Where the hell was I? Uh, inconvenience. Right. You're an inconvenience. Now you got me way off my path, talking to goddamn nerds or geeks or whatever the fuck you want to identify with. You know what? We'll go with dorks. And not just dorks. Now I'm wasting my time working with some kind of woke dork activists. Am I using that word right, woke? Uh, I don't think so. Anyway, a couple years back, I would've just popped two in your face for just seeing mine. Something is wrong with me. Gonna have to see my guy about that. Wait, you have a shrink? Just focus on the task at hand and maybe you survive this shit. Maybe.
You sure this is it? Man, don't you ever get tired of pointing guns at people? <laughs> nah, not really. Well, you're gonna have to start aiming at the other guys, right? Don't fuck this up. Yeah, likewise. All right, kid. I'm gonna stay up here with my scope in some kind of uh, support role. Sound good? Sounds real convenient for you. Sounds real convenient for you.
Squad, we have alerts of a hostile in your area. I'm gonna stay up here with my scope in some kind of, uh, support role. Sound good? Sounds real convenient for you. Yeah, heads up, you're gonna feel this one. What?
man. These guys are tapping into the data lines reserved for the hospitals. The ransomware is probably just a distraction to keep eyes off the data theft. Uh, what kind of theft? Medical records, most likely. Oh, yeah. You could resell that data for millions. A lot more than they'll get to unlock the system. Oh, shit, huh? So where's Anton? The backup of all the data's being sent to a luxury yacht. My guess is his. Fuck me. I know the one. I was just gonna blow it up to intimidate the Bratva. Don't blow it up. I need what's on it. Yeah, well, if Anton's on board, I need to make uh, an example. Up close and personal. You know what? Meet me outside. Sending you the coordinates. Did you see the preview yet? It looks good. A little irritating they didn't give more personality to enemy AI. All they do is stand around and bitch about bullshit like long hours and bad pay. Or brag about killing people, yeah. I'd love to hear them complain about real-life shit for a change. What are these guys into? What movies do they watch? What games do they play? Well, maybe we should go down to Dev Studio and voice our opinions, if you know what I mean. That's a long road trip. I don't get paid enough for road trips. Ooh.
find the trespass. Thanks for drawing the fire away from me. I owe you one. Yeah, man, fuck you. That was fun. You're a fun guy, you know. Yeah. Why don't you stick around and play some more? Now can do. Play date with Anton. Toodles. I tracked the Bratva hacker Anton to a fancy yacht. What about the psychotic suit guy? Under control. Wait, Bratva hackers get a yacht? We don't even have a bathroom. We literally have to go pee in the alley. You guys better not be pissing on my artwork. Well, just pan it up high and you won't have to worry about any splash damage. Ugh. I got a bitch that work up numbers in that pussy wet And every day she catching has to get the lappy yet She said she's stripping trying to get the fuck about the jets But they ain't none my business I'm just trying to get the neck A lot of rappers in my city have you niggas wet And I ain't never been the bitch I'm keeping shit a stack And someone go and tell the DJ that she bring it back I've been to Jesus Kitty Disco's at the Hammer Jacks I swear to God I can never love a dumb hoe She live on my own roads when she murder my own See all my niggas never love when we be sharing those I'ma go and tell the DJ that she brings us back. I love my city as it brought me, and I bet they know me. I love my city as it brought me, and I bet the rest of us. Your manager sticks to her guns like, you can't name your band this bullshit. 
No band with a swear in the name ever gets anywhere. Gab shot back with butthole surfers. But one, butthole isn't a swear. And two, they really shouldn't aspire to be like the butthole surfers. Sounds like Gab and the guys caved eventually. I love the name this bullshit. Listen to this bullshit, you know? Okay, so here's the rules. You have to be the first Whatever. one past the finish line. Sure. Obviously. Whatever. But if you don't finish your beer first, you're disqualified. And you can't drive and drink at the same time, so you've got to stop wherever you are and drink and risk being overtaken. Josh gets access to the go-kart track at night, so we won't get caught. We race like that all night. It's the best. I don't know. I'm addicted. I keep playing. I can't put it down for more than a couple of minutes. And I have been spending money like crazy on it. It's ridiculous. The thing is, every time you get to the end of a level, you have to wait like a day or two. But if you pay money, you can play the next level right away. And I, I can't wait. I have spent over $150 this month alone. It's ridiculous. I always love the bad poetry contest at Swelter Skelter, so I can't wait to hear what they have next time around. I tried submitting something a couple of years ago, but they didn't accept it. How sucky is that? My bad poetry was so bad, it didn't even get consideration in a bad poetry contest. Or does that mean it was actually good? I wasn't trying to make good poetry. I liked when they used to set up those police checkpoints to check for drunk drivers. I would get to roll up on them and impress them with my stone-cold sobriety. I chatted with an officer the other night and asked why they don't do those checkpoints anymore, and she said CTOS does that work for them now. Which is good, I guess. I liked when they used to set up those police checkpoints to check for drunk drivers. I would get to roll up on them and impress them with my stone-cold sobriety. I chatted with an officer the other night and asked why they don't do those checkpoints anymore. And she said CTOS does that work for them now. Which is good, I guess. Love the bad poetry contest as well. Your next best job. Study the game from fruit to
madre de Dios. Bro. Damn. I want to change the terms of our relationship. Knowing full well that you have little reason to trust me. I got zero reason to trust you, man. You crazy as hell. You know what? That's fair. That is, that is fair. But see, the thing is, I don't have any real reason to kill you anymore because I don't gain from it. So you can go ahead and put away your little ball gag there. Fuck no. It's nice, huh? Crawling with Bradfa. But the thing is, is you're gonna need me to thin out that herd a little bit so you can get in there and shut down that spyware. Ransomware, man. Whatever. Here's how I figure it. I clip Anton, shut down the operation. It's a win-win. Your people are happy, my group's happy, everybody's happy. Well, except for Anton, of course, because he's dead. <laughs> yeah. No, still don't trust you. It's a good instinct. Should hold on to that instinct. Huh. I'm gonna go, anyway. Uh, finish my mint chocolate chip, it's great. I hate mint chocolate chip. That's why I bought it. I don't care about Anton. I just need what's on his computer. I won't get in the way of your nerd shit. You don't get in the way of my master performance. Anyway, I don't need to get into the panic room. I just need to hack his camera. Just need to grab the ransom key and I'm out. Shit. I tried to download the ransomware key, but it was updating itself too fast. He's running live encryption. I need to cut the connection. Right. Somebody if it stops receiving hard. updates, it will lock on a password. Then it's yours to take. Can you pull up any work orders on the boat? I bet Anton has a fail safe. Already looking at them. Man, who is this guy? Already looking at them. Mm, you're right. He's got multiple relay points as backup. I've marked them for you. Thanks. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, just need to grab the ransom key and I'm out. Shit. I tried to download the ransomware key, but it was updating itself too fast. He's running live encryption. I need to cut the connection. Right. If it stops receiving updates, it will lock on a password. Then it's yours to take. Can you pull up any work orders on the boat? I bet Anton has a failsafe. Already looking at them. Mm, you're right. He's got multiple relay points as backup. I've marked them for you. Got Thanks. It. Dispatching our contractor now. Just need to grab the ransom key and I'm out. Shit. I tried to download the ransomware key, but it was updating itself too fast. He's running live encryption. I need to cut the connection. Right. If it stops receiving updates, it will lock on a password. Then it's yours to take. Can you pull up any work orders on the boat? I bet Anton has a failsafe. Already looking at them. Mm, you're right. He's got multiple relay points as backup. 
I've marked them for you. Thanks. Los Halcones have a location. Send the Sicario. Chinga tu puta madre. I don't got anyone to send. Sicario is coming. Con el levantón de escabrón. And who is this guy?
the hell, man? That's all of them, Josh. It was. Anton knows his security. I'm seeing two more backup relays just lit up. Oh, plans within plans. Hopefully not plans within plans. Within plans. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Psycho's gonna fuck this up. Got them all, Marcus. The ransomware key should be locked in place now. Perfect. I'll go hack back into Anton's computer and get the fuck out of here. All right, fingers crossed. Okay, it's downloading. Of course, there he is. Sorry, pal. Opportunity came up and, well, I'm an opportunist. This really shouldn't surprise you. Apologies, but be a dear and turn yourself in, will you? Having you as the culprit would be the icing on the cake scenario here. Unfucking believable Oh, and don't try and find me. You caught me in a good mood. Maybe on account of the mint chocolate chip, but I'm usually much less friendly. You're gonna catch a bullet one of these days, hopefully sooner than later. Lend me the first time. Bye for now. Did you guys get the ransomware key I sent? We got it. In fact, we're already working on restoring the hospitals. Something tells me they're not going to be too eager to let DedSec tinker with their security. Now, how do you plan to keep the Ruskies from locking them down again? Don't worry. The brothel won't make another attempt. Why not? Let's just say my new friend gave him a slap on the wrist. Are you cheating on us, Marcus? Hell no. I don't ever want to cross paths with that guy again. We've got plenty of members working legit jobs in the InfoSec community. We'll make sure the hospitals get a proper update through more official channels. Who's ready to watch the video? I just finished putting the last bit of love into it. Damn you fast. Let's see it. Shit. 
citizens of the Bay Area, your health care is under siege. siege, 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 siege. As politicians squander millions to create the ultimate invasive surveillance state, our hospitals struggle to provide basic services. The vast majority of medical equipment still runs on outdated operating systems, full of vulnerabilities. Exploits are all too easy to find online. The recent shutdown of local hospitals was perpetrated by hackers from the Bratva criminal group. Deadset has returned control to the owners, free of charge. Do so not expect banks. We expect action. Demand better use of your tax dollars. Demand secure medical systems that protect your private data. Demand a government that protects you. Deadsec has given you the truth. Do what you want.